Welcome to Let's Grow Up. So in this video we will dive into the fascinating world of pantographs. So one common question that arises is why pantographs don't seem to have wires explicitly for this purpose. So let's unravel this mystery. So firstly let's focus on the older pantograph. Unlike the modern design you will notice a wire. So this wire serves a different purpose. I will explain later. Additionally, the old locomotive, you can see some rooftop components. So now turning our attention to the WAG12 pantograph, you will observe a clear design of the rooftop, emphasizing the pantograph itself without additional clutter on the roof. When a pantograph makes contact with the overhead contact wire VG, the entire structure becomes electrified. This means that during contact the pantograph serves as conduct for electricity. To ensure safety and efficiency the pantograph is equipped with insulators. Clearly you can see these insulators. The pantograph base frame is fitted through these insulators. Next, the collected current is then transmitted through the pantograph base frame. This collected electricity is directed to various components on the locomotive's rooftop including the potential transformer, surge arrestor, resistor harmony and VCB yani vacuum circuit breakers which manage the electricity flow. Moreover, while the transformer responsible for converting the collect electricity is typically located beneath the locomotive, only around 50% of it is visible and the remaining portion is inside the locomotive. In my next hand, where the modern pantograph, so what is the purpose this wire? Actually, here you can see this. These are the carbon strip. Okay? This wire, here is a sensor inside this panto head. Here is a sensor. The sensor sends the fault. So, if there are any fault inside the panto head or carbon strip, the sensor automatically down the panto or send the information inside the crew. That's why you can see this wire in modern pantograph. But the old pantograph there is no this kind of technology. It collects the electricity from the base pen and then it transmit in the next step. So in locomotive you can see the under slag transformer, here is the transformer and this is the oil cooling system, external oil cooling chamber. So these are the step. So if you have ever wondered about the intricacies of how pantographs collect electricity from overhead wires, I hope this video has provided clarity. So thank you.